Ladies and gentlemen, dear viewers in Bahrain and around the world, welcome to another episode of We Have a Winner, taking place right here in Ma Ma. We'll be walking around, creating memories and beautiful smiles, and asking questions to see who will be the winners of this episode. So, stay tuned. Let's go. And we are here with more visitors to the mall. So, how are you today and what is your name? Hi, my name is Yahya Muhammad Ali. All right, Yahya. And? I am fine. Thank you because you asked for me. My name is Alia Muhammad. I love the answer. It's like you've raised beautiful kids, that's for sure. And tell me about yourself. What is your name, ma'am? My name is Hanan. Hanan. And your name? My name Beautiful family. Thank you so much and bless you pretty much in this month of Ramadan. How was Ramadan so far with you? Ramadan is great. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. So you're ready to pretty much have some fun and possibly, I would say most probably, you're going to win with us today here. So, simple questions, nothing to it. You ready? You ready? Yes, ready. You ready? Okay. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. Let's go. Now, birds. Do you like fast birds or slow birds? Fast birds. Like fast birds? Slow or fast? What, which one do you like? Fast. So let's talk about fast birds here. Now, which bird is the fastest? A chicken, an eagle, or a falcon? An eagle. An eagle? Okay. Chicken, a falcon, or an eagle? Falcon. Falcon? Yes, falcon. Falcon? Can I change my answer? If only if your mom says so. This falcon. It's falcon. Have you? Well, what about chicken? Have you seen a chicken run before? They're pretty fast. I mean, we have a movie, Chicken Run, right? This is very slow. Chickens are not slow, man. Come on, chickens can actually go to the Olympics. They're that fast. They can run. They can run. You've never seen a chicken run? But not fast than us, human. You want to race with a chicken and try? I bring you a chicken right now, man. They can run. I don't think. Okay, well, the fastest bird, because I didn't say who can run the fastest, who can fly the fastest. Chickens don't really fly. You know, last time I checked. <laughs> so, actually, it's the falcon. Congratulations, you got the first one right. Yay, yeah, right? Congratulations. But we're gonna see you run against a chicken. Uh, uh, let's see. I, th I think the chicken will outrun you. We'll see about that after Ramadan. We'll see about that. Okay, let's go to another question. All right. Ah, how many elements are there in the periodic table? I hope you're good in chemistry. How many elements are there in the periodic table? 116, 117, or 118? Oh, we got you with this one. 116, 17, or 18 for the periodic table. How many elements? I failed chemistry, so don't ask me. 117. 117. 117. Your husband knows chemistry? Yes. Yes. So what do you think your husband will say? 17, 18, or 16? 16. 16. Okay, and he said 17. And both of you are wrong. It happens, we can't get everything we want in the world. It's 118 actually. But you still have another chance. You ready? Yes. 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 I still want to see you race a chicken. <laughs> All right, let's go with this one. Ha. Huh. Okay, yeah. I think you would know this one because you know, pretty much you put a lot of effort to make sure that everybody's healthy and they drink enough water, you know, in suhoor or after iftar. How much does a liter of water weigh? Half a kilo, one kilo, or one kilo and a half? One kilo, I think. One kilo? What do you think? One kilo. One kilo. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, absolutely correct. Thank you very much. You won. Congratulations. Let's go with the gifts right now. Here is the first one. You got a voucher. Pretty cool stuff. But, but, doesn't stop here. Here's another one. And another one. You see, we don't stop here. 
month of Ramadan, you know, it's all about generosity, definitely. And another one, oh, look, you're done? Because we're not, actually. To the guy who runs faster than a chicken. Here we go. Can you hold that? Oh, look at that. Well, congratulations, ladies and gentlemen, right here. And you never know, maybe after eight, we're going to have a special show called Chicken Runs. But let's do it right here. Ladies and gentlemen, came across this beautiful family right here, you know, visiting the mall. How are you today? I'm oh, fine, sir. Great. And what is your name? Jaram. Jaram. And your name, sir? Sinwas. Sinwas. Okay, so we are here in Ma Mall, pretty much having fun, a good walk. In this beautiful month, the blessings of Ramadan may be bestowed upon you and your son with some crazy gifts brought to you by in Ma Mall. All you have to do is answer three questions and get to right. Are you ready? 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 You ready? All right, cool. Now, let's talk about fish and talk about the big creatures in the sea. Do you like sharks? No. Why? Because uh, I don't have uh, anything uh, I... Anyone I like, I don't, can't eat it. So, sharks are bad? Yeah. What do you think? Do you like sharks? What? Huh? Sharks, yeah, yeah. You like sharks? So you like sharks, you don't like sharks. Have you ever eaten a shark before? No. Do you want to try eating a shark? No. No, I am eating. Yeah. You eaten a shark before? Yeah. Where? Telangana. Whoa, man, okay, well, that's a shark smile right there. Look at that smile. That's how a shark would... Look. Yeah, I mean, I think that's why pretty much you ate a shark because you have a shark smile. I can see that definitely happening. But how about we ask you about sharks, especially that you eat in a shark before. Now, how many bones do sharks have? One, ten, none. None. None? What do you think? None. You sure? I mean, I mean, it's a big, big, you know, it's, it swims, it bites, it has big teeth. Like none? It doesn't have a single bone? No. None. What do you think? None. That's it, you guys are confident. We're gonna lock it down on none. Well, I will not argue with a person who eaten a shark before. Congratulations, you got the first one right. Yes. It's none. Amazingly enough, sharks have no bones. Don't ask me, but, but it is what it is. I mean, he eaten a shark, you would know. Okay, next question. All right, I'll, let's go with that. Havana is the capital of what country? Bahrain, Cuba, Mexico, Japan. Japan. Havana is the capital of Bahrain, Cuba, Mexico. 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 Uh, what, like, what questions? The capital. Okay, Havana is the capital of what country? Mexico. Mexico. So Havana is in Mexico. Yeah. Mexico. You sure? Mexico. And you're not correct. It's in Cuba. Cuba. Beautiful. Havana, na, na, na. You mean, you come on, the song. Okay, you know, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. That's why we have three questions to give you a chance, a third chance. This will be a deal breaker. Either you make it or not, okay? I, for some reason, you said Japan earlier, so I'm going to ask you something. I don't know, maybe, related or not. See, I'll throw a hint over there. In what, in what language does Konnichiwa means hello? Konnichiwa means hello in a certain country, and in a certain language. Is it Arabic? Is it Portuguese? Portuguese. See, I, you see I, I got nervous because I want you to win. So is it Portuguese, or is it in Arabic, or Japanese? What Konnichiwa? is hello in which country? Japan. Japan? Japan. You watch anime? Yes. That's why. That's why, yes. Konnichiwa means hello in Japan. Congratulations. And you're the winners. Awesome stuff. So how about we give you a gift? Yeah? Let's go. Here's one gift. Are you, are you happy with one gift? That's it? You sure? But we're not happy with only one gift. We're going to give you another one. 
You're more happy? More happy. You, you want to be happier? Yeah. Of course you would. Here's another one. How do you feel now? Huh? How do you no, feel? Happy. You want to be happier? Shh. Okay. How about another one? We'll make you happier. How do you feel now? Fantastic. That's it? Yeah. Fantastic. You want to go, like, you know, higher than this? Oh, fantastic. You want to go higher? Yeah. Let's go. Here we go. How do you feel now? Do you want more? Lots of happy. You're happy. It's just too happy. Are we, are we done? Yeah. Happy, too much happy. Are we done? Yeah. You're, you're done? Done. I'm not done. Okay, here you go with another bag. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Thank you, thank you. How do you feel now? No, fantastic. Okay, you know what? The way you said fantastic, I'm gonna end the I'm gonna end it with this. You feel happy, you feel fantastic? Yeah, fully fantastic. He feels fully fantastic with his son who eaten shark in his life. I'm not sure why, what kind of a choice he had to eat a shark in one part moment of his life. You eaten a shark? Yeah, shark. Yes. Right here with Mr. Fantastic. And I'm here with another visitor to the mall. How are you today? I'm good. How about you? I'm good. How are you? How are you today? The smile says it all. That's what we need. A beautiful smile, pretty much. So we got three questions. He answered two right. We got a lot of giveaways by Inmat Mall. They're very generous in this beautiful month, the holy month of Ramadan itself, and they just want to make sure everybody leaves with a smile. So today I am confident you're going to leave with a smile. So are you ready? I'm ready. For the first question, what is your name? My name is Om Faisal. Om Faisal. And how old is she and what is her name? Uh, she, she, uh, her name is uh, Anut. Uh, uh, her age is uh, two, uh, two years and a uh, half. Inshallah, mashallah. Well, we are ready to pretty much bring more fun and generosity to your way. Okay, so you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Of course, when you cook, you have to make sure of certain weights, milligrams of certain things. Even Anud agrees, right? When you cook, you have to make sure of certain weights, like how many grams of this, how many grams of that. So how about this? How many milligrams would make a gram? A hundred, a ten, one thousand. One thousand. One thousand. You sure? Yes, I'm sure. You see, I'm not gonna argue because pretty much I know the, a lot of work you have to put in when you go to the kitchen. I have to make sure everything is right. So she is right. <laughs> Definitely one thousand. Okay, great. Now that's the first one. Let's go for a second. You ready for that? Yes, I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, cool, cool, cool. How about this? Now. So even Anu wants to join, right? She is ready to make it happen. <laughs> now, what, what, me, what? Do you want to answer this question? How about this? Yeah, you see, a smile, always a smile takes place. So you want to answer the question? So when we have the mic, all of a sudden you just go quiet, right? You just, how about you just want attention then? Okay, Anu, you know, third one is strike out, okay? I'm watching. All right. Oh. <laughs> okay. So, how about this? What is the world's oldest continuously inhabited city? Would it be Egypt, Damascus, or India? Maybe Egypt. Egypt? You sure? Egypt? Hello. Oh, hello. What? what is it? Is it in Egypt? Is it down there? Okay, I don't think that's the right place. So again, Egypt, Damascus, or Delhi? Delhi. Well, actually, it's Damascus. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, I know. The... Inhabit. I gave you three. No props. Let's go for a third one. Let's go for a third one. How about that? You ready for a third one? You ready for a third one? Or maybe we're gonna go down and here we go over there. All right. All right. Now we're gonna go for our third question. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, good. Let's go for a third question. I know you're ready. She's ready, pretty much. Okay, let's go with this. What does the white dove symbolizes? Would it be nature, peace, or sadness? 
Peace. Peace. The symbol of a white dove is peace. What is the symbol of a white dove? You see, I know the trick here. So it's peace. Yes, I'm sure of that. You're sure about that? Yeah, yeah. And she is correct, definitely it's peace. And what is the symbol of a white dove? Congratulations, let's go for this right now. Here is your first gift. I'm gonna give you a gift right now. How about this, Anut? Right? How about another one? Oh, she is practical, she is practical. How about this? Anut, you wanna take another one? Oh, you like the big stuff, don't you? I like her. I like her. She just like knows exactly what to get her stuff. Okay, well, we're not done yet. I know here's another one. What are we gonna do with that? What are we gonna do with that? She is smart. And here we go with the big one. Congratulations right here, ladies and gentlemen, with other winners with the show itself here at the Mount Mall. Congratulations. It's heavy. Have a nice Mother Day. Thank you so much for that. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, winners. And ladies and gentlemen, this was it for today's episodes. A lot of smiles, a lot of great moments taking place right here in our show. We have a winner taking place right here in Enmont Mall. Of course, big shout out and an amazing stuff that took place within Mont Mall for their support. And we'll be seeing you again in another episode. We have a winner right here in Enmont Mall, Bahrain International TV.